Hello and good evening, this is Rod Pozuelo from Curval.com and uh, today I'm going to show you a very useful trick. This is something that they released, I think, this this month or last month and it is how to automatically uh, download Power BI desktop when the team Power BI team uh, releases a new version. So if you don't know how to do it, uh, make sure you follow this video. It will allow you to download the Power BI desktop without um, admin uh, um, access to the computer, right? Because if you are belong to a big corporation, you know, a lot of the users do not have uh, the ability to download their own programs on the computer. So if you do it this way, you will get the downloads every month without any hassle. So let's do it. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is you need Windows 10. It doesn't work on the old version of Windows and the reason for that is um, you need to have access to the Windows Store and that is not available on older versions of Windows. So Windows Store, just search on your bar and then you will get uh, access to this uh, there and here we have the Windows Store. So what you need to do here is basically search for Power BI. Uh, Power BI. And you will get two uh, apps. Uh, the first one is actually the Power BI desktop and the other one is the, the first version of Power BI. I don't know, this was like when all these things were just available in Excel. I guess this is the PowerBI.com available for Windows. So I actually by mistake downloaded this without actually reading what it was. This is not what you want. What you want is a Power BI desktop. It says it here. So I've already installed it. What you need to do is just click here on launch or on install and then it will install it for you. And then uh, you can just launch it as you will launch any other application. One of the things that you have to keep in mind is that it actually makes a new installation. So you might believe that the old Power BI file or Power BI installation will get this installed. It, it doesn't, okay? You have to install it again. And something that I actually forgot when I installed this is that, of course, all the settings that you have on Power BI um, desktop will disappear. So you will have, to, for example, to enable all the preview features if you want to get them back. So um, make sure you remember these, otherwise you will think, like, okay, where did my stuff go? Um, so you will have to, let me show you. No, it doesn't show, but you will have two installations of Power BI desktop. You need to remove the old one. You don't need it anymore. And then every time Microsoft team uh, releases a new Power BI desktop, it will automatically install on your computer. So if you are uh, an employee in a big corporation, you know, you always have to call IT. Oh, I would like to have my new, um, my new Power BI desktop downloaded. It takes a while. I have these um, issues with customers, you know, they have uh, like, you know, big companies. So, Hopefully this will help it. Unfortunately, it only works with Windows 10 and there are a lot of companies, especially big companies that have not yet adopted Windows 10. So this might not be a solution for you, but hopefully it will be soon as soon as your IT department manages to get Windows 10 working. So as soon as they do, just make sure you install this. You will love it. So this is actually all for today. Uh, it is a short video, but very useful in case you're having these issues. Uh, if you liked the video, always let me know by liking it or by sharing it with somebody. Uh, if you have any comments, questions, suggestions, let me know on the comment box or any of the social channels I list below. And uh, subscribe, I publish Power BI videos every Monday, Wednesday and Friday. Friday is dedicated to DAX Friday. So I call it DAX Friday, this is dedicated to DAX, learning DAX. And uh, as always tell you, make sure you click the bell to receive notifications. When I publish a new video, YouTube stopped doing that for a while ago. So have a great, great evening and I'll see you again on Wednesday. Bye.